Okay, so this is the mystery gadget. Take a look at it. I'm here in Seattle, and it kind of looks like the top of the Space Needle. In fact, take a look at the Space Needle right up there. We are absolutely in Seattle, Washington, and this is the mystery gadget. So uh, I've got some amazing celebrities, actually Seattle celebrities, to try to figure out what the heck that is, including the host of King Five's New Day Northwest, Amity Idrisi, former running back for the Washington Huskies, Terry Holliman, the comic genius behind The Daily Show, The Letterman Show. She's now Mad the Kitchen, Madeline Smithberg, Pike Place Public Market Concierge, James Weaver, and Pike Place Fishmonger, also Fish Thrower, Ryan Rector. Look at him throw that fish. They're all gonna be trying to figure out what the heck that is. What is that? What the heck is that? Welcome to What the Heck Is That? The new gadget game show. Okay, take a good look at you know this product? No! Okay, here's the next mystery gadget right here. Is this used for media? Not used for media, nothing to do with CDs. Does it have something to do with music? Nothing to do with music at all. Okay, here is our mystery gadget. Take a good look, everybody at home. Now, James, give me some questions to try to figure out what the heck is that? Does it hold music? It doesn't hold music, nothing to do with the CD whatsoever. I mean, seriously, what the heck is that? <laughs> That's what we're trying to figure out. Toilet paper. No, but you're actually kind of getting warm. Here's the big hint, perfect for Mad in the Kitchen. It's a kitchen product. Would it be used in the kitchen? Ding, 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 it is used in the kitchen. Does this, is this, do you use it in the sink? You do not use it in the sink. Um, is it used in food preparation? I wouldn't say no, not in preparation. Is its orientation this way? Does it sit like this? No, it sits like that. Okay. Excellent question. Very engineering mind of you. Yes. Okay. Do you use it in food preparation? I'd say no, it's not used in food preparation. Would I use this to serve food with? Not for serving food, and I'll give you a hint. It's used on the countertop. Does it go like this? No. So it's like this. Yes. Do you put this on top of on top of something? It does go on top of something. Excellent. Well, it goes. Does it go on the counter? It does go on the counter. Ooh, this kitchen skills showing up. Is it? A place to put my spoon while I'm cooking? <laughs> no, 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 not for that. Is it used for food? It is used in the kitchen, but I wouldn't really say it's for food. Do you use it with bottles? Would I use this in cleaning in my kitchen? I would say yes, it helps you with cleaning something in the kitchen, yes, and it works with something you have already in the kitchen. Do you use it with vegetables? Not with vegetables. What in the world? I, I am I am at a loss here. But it goes in the kitchen. Does it go in the stove? It does not go in the stove, no. Would you use it maybe with a sponge? Not with a sponge. Is this like used for organization in the kitchen? I wouldn't say organization, but it does take something that's already in the kitchen and makes it work a little better. But what else do you have in your kitchen on the countertop that you use for cleaning? A brush? Not a brush. What else do you have on the countertop? Everybody has soap? it. Do, nope. I don't know. I mean, am I am I uncleanly? Yeah, we're unhygienical in our I homes, mean, apparently. I mean, um, <laughs> what do we have? A sponge? No, you already say sponge. sponge. Okay. Towels, soap. Towels? 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 This rag? I'm giving them a hint. I'm kind of giving it away now. No, well, you know, I mean, we're struggling we're, we're, here. We're having trouble here in Seattle. Paper towels. Paper towels. Paper. Oh! oh! You bet. This is a, a paper towel holder. You just stick you it just... up here? Nope. No. Oh. 
Is it a UFO? Not a UFO. And what's a UFO doing in the kitchen? Does this attach to your kitchen appliance? It attaches to something, but I wouldn't call it an appliance. You may be my cousin, but I'm going to take you out of my will. Uh, damn. I'm stumped on this one. It's on the countertop, and it helps with cleanup. So what do you oh, think? Oh, paper towel holder. I've never felt so stupid in my entire life. It looks like a DVD. It does look like a DVD, but it's not. Oh, does it prop up cookbooks? No. Uh, what does it do to the paper towel holder? So you got your paper towels. It orientates. Did we say this way? So it goes on the top of paper towels. Paper towel holder. Okay, so he's in the right category. You're right area. But it doesn't hold. You already have a paper towel holder. What does this do? It kind of, how does that augment the paper towel holder? That's what you have to figure out. Ah! You giving up? I'm giving up. I feel terrible, but come on, people. Like, where's the audience? Give me a hint. Th this is a kitchen diva. You I think, know, I mean, I've mad in the kitchen. I've so humiliated in my entire life. Oh, wait, do you put it on the bottom and then That's fold cool. the edges over and put use it, it on as the a top? wiper? It goes on the top. Did you put it on top? So you put pressure on it so you can hold it? Exactly. For what purpose? To take pepper towels off without spinning it, maybe? Not only can he throw fish, but he knows his <laughs> gadgets. <laughs> Thank you. Does it keep you from getting grease on your face it's a paper towel topper so when you pull you don't pull a hundred and this off works like I with do. my already the paper towel holder i have exactly it works with that's everything. genius it is genius it who is genius. thought of this i feel like a moron i really especially because it's a kitchen thing so if your goal is to make me look dumb never 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 kitchen accomplished. <laughs> That was a tough one, but to see how it works, you put this on top of the paper towel, and then when you try to pull that paper towel, it's easier, so you can pull one piece at a time. They don't all just pull out. The topper really does it. It's under $10. Go to the papertoweltopper.com. Great little tool right here. Now, if you like this product and you like this segment, please hit the like button and share and subscribe. Put some comments below. I want to hear your thoughts. Do you like this idea or do you think it's not a good idea? Let me know. Also, if you hit that little bell next to the share button, well then, every time we post another edition of What the Heck Is That? You will be notified. So once again, I'm here in Seattle from the Space Needle. Take a look. There it is right up there. Uh, take a look. Isn't that cool? Here doing another episode of What the Heck Is That? I hope you'll join me for the next episode of What the Heck Is That? Take care. <laughs>